So let's just take our time this time, instead of jumping the gun in the middle of all these guards. Could probably do to recharge my weapon as well. What do I got? Soul stone. Common soul gem. Weapons. There we go. Fully charged. I'm gonna need that for all these assassinations. It's a little bit of a waste of an enchant, but uh, that's what I'm doing. Okay. Actually, he's probably going to stay the night at the Bannered Mayor, isn't he? Yeah, he is. That's where he's going right now, I, I bet. Let's, let's just follow him. I think he's actually going to the inn. If he's going to the inn, he's going to be really easy for me to take out, because I'll just get him in his sleep. And that should satisfy the requirement of me killing him in town. Let me see if there's any details I'm forgetting. In one of the cities. Okay. As long as I kill him in one of the cities, I should be fine. So I want to get that bonus. I always want to get the bonuses, because uh, they're, they're awesome and cool, and you get cool things. If this works the same way as it does in Oblivion, anyway. Okay. <laughs> I'm really, really tempted to just backstab him right here. That's not the way we need to do this, though. He's going... He's still going the right way. Dude. This is starting to get annoying. Okay, there shouldn't be this many people out at midnight. Uh, in Oblivion, like, everyone fell asleep, and the towns were ghost towns at midnight, but it's like... I don't know what the hell the deal is. I can understand this guy. He, he's, he's with the companions, and the camp companions really don't sleep. Here we go. This is what I wanted to see. Okay. Let's get in here. Let's beat him to the punchline. Come on in. Let me know if you need anything, or take a seat by the fire, and I'll send someone over. Honestly, though, if I had a suspicion that someone in full black armor was stalking me, I wouldn't, you know, completely ignore them. He's sleeping in the guest bed. Oh, that's awesome. Awesome for me. Okie dokie, guys. We'll take that level up in a second. Um, I can't think of a good song. What? What song? Are you eating in your sleep? What the heck? <laughs> He's eating in his sleep. I hear the little crunchy noises. That's weird. Um, I was gonna clean my room, and then I got high. Wah! That was a good one. Okay. Let's put this letter on his body. Uh, da, 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 da. Ooh, look at all this crazy stuff. I kind of want to steal all of his armor. Um, but we're not going to do that. I, I don't know if that would screw it up or not. I want to read this. My son, in order... Uh, uh, you are... Authorize to speak with my voice and administer my hand, guys. I cannot do that. Uh, love you and your face. Commander Moreau. Okie dokie. So where's this incriminating letter? Incriminating letter. Incriminating letter. It's in under books. Incriminating letter. Yay. Aw, oh, sweet. Nothing happened. Well, second time's the charm. Went rather well after that 
initial screw up. By Sithis, there's a breeze in here. Hello. Ah, at last. I've been anxiously awaiting your return. Yes, he is dead. Yes, I know. As does Astrid. You have done well, and have earned both your reward and a bonus, as I have mentioned. But you should know that we have a more pressing matter to deal with. Oh, we gotta it's freaking screw with the gesture Cicero again. There's been an incident. You should proceed into the sanctuary. I'll let Astrid explain. Are you kidding me? Just try to relax, Bizarre. Let the elixir do its work. You'll feel better shortly. The hell's going on? Thank you, dear. You are most kind. The jester's cut feels as bad as it looks, I'm afraid. Damn it, this never should have happened. We knew better. We knew better, and still we let our guards down. Ugh. I'll admit, even I'm having a hard time disagreeing with you. Marrow is dead, I know, but we've got bigger problems right now. He went apeshit. The fool went absolutely berserk. He wounded Vizara, tried to kill me, and then he fled. I knew that lunatic couldn't be trusted. Oh, it's true, I'm afraid. Cicero was a little whirlwind, slashing this way and that. It, it would have been funny if he weren't trying to murder us all. Yeah, that does take the humor out of it, usually. About the Night Mother, how she was the true leader of the Dark Brotherhood, and Astrid was just a pretender. Look. We've got to deal with this situation. You've got to deal with. Look, we've got to deal. Yeah, with you just said that. Come on. You've got. Quit to glitching out my freaking context. Uh, what do you want me to do? I want you to find that miserable little fool and end his life. Of course you do. But first, find my husband. Make sure he's all right. <gasps> Puppy's gone. After the attack. Onbjorn flew into a rage. When Cicero left, Onbjorn went after him. They disappeared into the wild. No, not puppy! Search Cicero's room. Maybe there's something in there that sheds some light on where he might have gone. Let me know the minute you find something. I've got to see to Vizara and calm everyone down. Rested by a fool. Puppy! Now, hmm? Hush, Vizara. You were very brave. Ask her to do all the dead and Okay, let's see here. Herkadurkadurkadur. Where's his room at? Oh, it's over here. Off in the middle of God knows where. Hmm. There's his journals. Journal final volume. I have written the letters so polite, so official to Astrid and Skyrim. Her sanctuary still stands, still operates, but how? No listener means no black sacrament. No black sacrament means no contracts. Her family can abandon the old ways and still survive, still kill, but that is that family still the Brotherhood? Or something else? Something new? Something different? Something wrong? Something wrong? Still we must go. Tomorrow we set sail, float on a boat through the moat called the sea. Her and me. Boink. Sick, sick, sick of the rocking, rolling, tossing, throwing on the gray, gray waves. I've been reading of Skyrim, of the good days, of the old days, of the old ways. There was another sanctuary once, a Dawnstar sanctuary. Good, ancient, and strong, blessed by Sithis. Cicero will go there, no need of Astrid. And now we know! And that's all I need to read. Actually, I want to take it. There we go. That's, uh, that's the little part that stood out to me. Mushrooms! Little part that stood out to me there. Did he take the night mother with him? I'm guessing he probably did. Yeah, he probably did. I'm not even gonna check. Actually, I'll be passing through there anyway. Mm? No, she's still here. Hi. Hogme! Alright, anyway. Weird. Okay, I don't know why she left her. Or bleh, he left her. Have you found something? Yep. His diary. Good. Good. Does it say where he may be headed? Dawnstar Sanctuary. The Dawnstar Sanctuary. Whatever for. It's better than this shithole. Doesn't matter. You need to leave. Now. Every moment counts. So I want you to take my horse. His name is Shadowmere. You'll find him outside by the pool. Huh. Let's just say he's 
one of us. Goobble gobble. Find on beyond. Make sure my husband's all right. And then send that jester's twisted little soul to the void in as many pieces as possible. All right. Um Yeah, that's what I want to know. Did something set him no, off? Nothing. At least nothing I'm aware of. Well, if I'm being honest, I haven't exactly been discreet lately in expressing my frustration with this whole situation. Obeying the Night Mother, you being the listener, it's ridiculous. No offense. Cicero may have overheard me talking to one of the others about the Night Mother. It's possible I was not entirely respectful. Stupid bitch. To this far. To attempt to murder the leader of a sanctuary. Cicero must pay with his life. There is no other option. I think there is another option. It's your fault. Isn't there any way we can work this out? Look, the Dark Brotherhood is a family. This sanctuary is a family. And we've always welcomed those shunned by society. Werewolves, wizards, eternal ten-year-old vampires. What does it matter? In truth, I've rarely met a lunatic I haven't liked. Cicero's problem isn't his madness. It's an adherence to an ancient, outmoded way of life. The Night Mother's ways simply are not our ways. Oh, I understand. He just couldn't accept that. And now he'll have to pay the price. Hmm. Well, what do we know about Dawnstar Sanctuary? Oh, it's ancient. Apparently one of the first sanctuaries in Skyrim. It hasn't been used by the Brotherhood in close to a hundred years. If you say Cicero has gone there, it stands to reason that he's familiar with the place. That means you'll be fighting him on his own ground. Tread carefully. You know, I kind of don't want to kill him. Damnable jester. It might just be me. I'm hoping it doesn't make me kill him, because I think it's not completely his fault. All this nonsense, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what the hell. Anyway, let's go stop and get our bonus, and then after that... Hang on a second. Let me see here if there's a quest for this. Uh... What? Mm -hmm. Receive a reading from Olivia the Feeble. I want to see where that is. Because I kind of want to do that. Where is Olivia the Feeble? She... Oh. I guess she's probably in Whiterun. Okay, whatever. Let's go talk to our horse. Because we have a horse now, apparently. Shadowmere. That sounds familiar, if I do say so myself. Sounds really familiar. Whoa! It's a party! Ah! Okay, I'm sorry. Um... Let's see here. Alto. Holy crap! Why does this lady have so much shit? Who was this? I am, I am so confused. Hello. Hi, pony. You're a pony. <laughs> Look at my horse, my horse is amazing. He's a link, he is it tastes like raisin. His mane turns into a plane and it turns back again. Okay, I'm done. Um, what were you doing? We were doing something. We were doing something. Um, I want to go. We gotta go Dara, Dawn Star Sanctuary. We'll do that. Um, I want to go to Whiterun first.